In this video, we will go through how to set up individual product settings for your online store. Found in inventory, in an individual product, and in the online store tab, these group of settings allow you to be in control of how this individual product appears on your rental website and how its product page is found by customers browsing the web. First up, we have the online store appearance settings. This starts with if you wish to display this product on the online store or not. For some products, they are simply for your team to add onto orders manually, and you don't want your customers to see them on the online store. For this, you can deselect show in online store, scroll down and hit save. For every other type of product that you do want to display online, keep this selected. Now for the sorting order. If you put the lowest number to this product and paste the entire product catalog on your online store, this product will appear first. If you want it to appear last, you can go into your inventory and count how many products you have in your store and place the largest number to this product's sorting order. The product catalog will appear as such, and if you place the lowest number in the sorting order, the product will appear first, and if you place the largest number out of your inventory in the sorting order, the product will appear last. Now for the online store description. This is the small section of text that you can place next to or underneath your product in the online store that will describe it to your customers. This could be something that describes the look, age, condition, or size of the product. You have a few formatting options to add paragraphs, um, add some lines, and choose the formatting of your text, for example. You can even add in a link. So alongside this text, you can also add a video or replace the text with a video altogether. Uh, a video for your product descriptions on the online store is really helpful to show your customers exactly what the product looks like, its size, in perspective, and any installation methods as well. You can just press the add button and the embed option, and you can paste any embed or HTML code or enter the URL from Vimeo or YouTube to include this video. And once you're happy with it, scroll down and hit save. Now onto this product's SEO settings. For those of you who are new to online reservations, SEO stands for Search Engine Optimization. It is essentially the choice of words for the page titles and the page title description or meta description of those pages that make sure that your website appears as close to first on the list of search engine results in Google, for example, as possible. And just before we get started, you can completely skip this next step with the SEO settings if you have a website with an external provider. So if you have your website with Shopify, Squarespace, WordPress, Weebly, for example, these settings here won't affect that website, so you can leave them blank. This is only to adjust the SEO and the ranking of your web page results if you have a website with Bookable's own rental website builder. If you have a website with an external provider, such as Shopify, for example, you can reach out to that web builder um, directly and get any assistance that they may provide for your SEO. Customers are likely to search something like wedding rentals near me or wedding rentals with their location or the specific product name itself, uh, which search engines like Google will combine their location and these search words to find the best possible matches for that customer. Your choice of words here for your page titles and their descriptions, as you can see, are key in making sure that you match with what your customer is likely to search when looking for rental providers like yourself on Google. The better they match, the higher your page appears on the list of Google results, for example. Let's start with your page title. Whether you have your own website that you will or have already connected Bookable to, or are creating a website from scratch using Bookable's Rental Website Builder, each product on your online store will receive its own page title on Google, which will appear if the customer searches something very similar to your product name. Bookable automatically creates a page title for you in your SEO settings, matching your product name exactly. But you can change this and preview how this looks in the example box here. Bookable has created an example box to display how this page link will appear in your Google search results and an SEO page title must contain your target keyword. This keyword tells both Google and your searcher that your web page is very relevant to their search query. 
So if they're looking for most popular wedding dining table, for example, maybe you'll want to include that key search term in your page title. Once you're happy with it, scroll down and hit save. Now onto the meta description. This is the text that provides the short description of the page. Google and other search engines can use this description in the snippet shown in the search results to give uh, some context and a description of the content the customer can expect when clicking into the page. It's one of the first things people will likely see when searching for something, so optimizing this is crucial for your SEO. It is your chance to persuade users to click on your result. Now hit save, and now onto this product's embeddable component settings. If you plan on connecting Bookable to a website of your own, then these settings are for you. On your online store, you can choose to display this product in a few different ways. The first is a simple product catalog, which appears automatically on the rental website builder in its own page, or can be pasted manually into your website with just one easy code if you have your website already set up with a different provider. This suits many businesses as it gives a simple tile with a pop-up and all the information at your fingertips. But for many businesses, maybe they wish to have their most popular products pasted in a different design on their homepage, for example. Out of the embeddable component options, you have an option to place a product card, a detail view, or an add to cart button. The first is the simple product card. This uses the same size and design of the product card we saw on the previous page as it would appear in your catalogue, but you can have the choice to place it in a different page or section of your website to stand out. It only displays the product details when you click the card to bring up the pop-up. Next is a detailed view. A detailed view is essentially placing what would have appeared in the product card pop-up directly on the page. It will show a detailed product view, including an image on the left with a description underneath the Add to Reservation button, if you were to include one, the pricing information, the Add to Cart button, and the pop-up availability calendar. So it is this horizontal looking tile here, placed directly on your page without the need to click on the product card first. The last and most popular method is the Add to Cart button. If you want to choose how big your product images appear or choose your specific font or size of text for the online store, then this is for you. What you will be able to do is paste the image, the product name and the description directly on your website as if you were making a product outside of Bookable. And you can connect this simply by adding this Add to Cart button to your product description, depending on which website builder you go with. This connects the two and allows you to have a bit more control over the design and layout of your bookable products on your website. For all three of these options, the appropriate codes appear at the bottom. For most website providers such as Squarespace, Shopify, Weebly and more, you'll have the HTML codes here which you can copy to clipboard and paste directly in your web pages of your web editor. And for WordPress sites, if you're using WordPress and or WooCommerce, you've got the short code here that you can also copy to your clipboard and paste directly in your site. And that's a wrap. You have now successfully learnt the best settings to choose when choosing your individual product online store settings in Bookable.